NCRAC is a high-speed network authentication cracking tool. It was built to help companies secure their networks by proactively testing all their hosts and networking devices for poor passwords. Security professionals also rely on NCRAC when auditing their clients. NCRAC was designed using a modular approach, a command line syntax similar to NMAP and a dynamic engine that can adapt its behavior based on network feedback. It allows for rapid yet reliable large-scale auditing of multiple hosts. NCRAC's features include a very flexible interface, granting the user full control of network operations, allowing for very sophisticated brute forcing attacks, timing templates for ease of use, runtime interactions similar to NMAPs, and many more. It supports a lot of protocols including RDP, SSH, HTTP or HTTPS, SMB, POP3, VNC, FTP, and Telnet. NCRAC by default is already installed on Kali Linux, but if it's not, I will put the command on screen. This IP is my target for this demo purpose, which is a meta-sploitable machine. I will be demonstrating the attack on FTP protocol, which if you don't know is used for file transferring. Now let's check the FTP port on the target if it's open or not, and it's open as you can see. For our first attack we will be using the NCRAC's default word list, and we will specify to use it pairwise and dash V for verbosity, and it has started the attack. After some times, as you can see, it has found some credentials. Let's try to log in with it. Now let's stop it, and you want to use your own word lists of usernames and passwords. Let's do it. The dash U is for usernames word list. Let me show you my word lists that I have for this demo. As you can see, I have these two word lists. Dash P is for password list. And after some times, it has found the credentials. Now let's see how to save the result to a file. Let's say you want to stop the scan as soon as it finds the credential. You just need to specify the dash F switch at the end. I will stop the scan now as I don't need it. If you are scanning, let's say, hundreds of IPs, you can specify the dash IL switch. Now let's say you unintentionally close the scan, and Crack saves the session for you. Let's see the above scan that we cancelled and resume it from there. I hope you find value in this tutorial. I'd appreciate a thumbs up and a follow. Thanks.